Barry Crypto decided to exit scam all of their investors. So here I am on Trustpilot. And as you can see, you know, Barry.im, uh, we can see a lot of negative one star reviews. Now, I, I don't know why this is positive. First of all, if you go to their website, if I click on this, it goes to, yeah, some redirect deceptive site ahead. Um, not sure what's going on over there. Phishing error. Uh, but, but then this guy comes in 29 minutes ago. Barry has been great to me and my group. <laughs> okay. <laughs> they literally exit scammed. See, uh, this person says I can't access my $859. Well, that's what happens when you decide to invest in a Ponzi scheme, right? Biggest scam ever scam lost all my money in here cause it got locked up into a coin for 90 days and I can only withdraw the $2 I have. <laughs> okay. I mean, that's what happens, right? You're, you're really just playing Russian roulette with these Ponzi schemes because you just don't know when they are going to exit scam. The people that make most of the money are the people that recruit. They got to, they know how to recruit people that are actual affiliates to the company, but the people that lose out are the ones that want to use the platform as a passive income stream. Right. And those are the majority of the people. So this is why you're seeing a lot of negative reviews, one star, one star, one star. So how do you know if something is a Ponzi scheme? Number one, if they're not registered to any kind of, you know, SEC or financial regulator, it's already a red flag. Number two is if the ownership is not transparent about themselves, that is a huge red flag. Why would you invest in something where the owners are not being transparent? They're hiding behind something. Right there, they could be anywhere. These people could be who I don't know. They could be anywhere in like I don't know Russia, Africa. I don't know. A lot of those Ponzi schemes, they pretend they are from somewhere else, but really they're from somewhere else, right? Uh, so, and a lot of them have like fake CEOs as well. Uh, I reviewed a bunch like that, but man, I really feel for some of these people here, scammers. With almost twenty thousand dollars and thousands of tokens, they still demand fifty dollar for withdrawal activation. I've used a trans scan and discovered every time a person deposits, it takes minutes. They make a withdrawal of funds out of the platform. They are genuinely professional scammers, man. If you invested $20,000 in a legit platform, you'll be making anywhere between 20% to hundred percent a month. I'm um, not a month, sorry, a year, not a month. I wish, but anyway, I meant a year. Uh, this is why it's super important you do your due diligence. Okay. Um, here's another one. Oh, that's just another kissing butt. You are all you are also scamming Barry. Why why is there four star though? Most of the people talking trash about Barry are those that are trading with different accounts under the same IP. They're also scamming Barry. All their accounts has been blocked and here condemning Barry. Barry, the good people are still with you. Uh, I don't know about that, dude. Okay, this was May 15th. Their website is down. <laughs> so there goes that whole thing. Terror scam. You cannot withdraw your funds, uh, which are, withdraw your, I probably meant funds. Uh, Pure scam. Yep, your funds. If you're a true leader, why still recruit people while you cannot withdraw? Yeah, that's another thing. Some, you know why? Because they're not really invested. They're just recruiting them and they're getting commissions, right? But at this point, their website is down. So even the affiliates, if they're still pushing this, are losing out. Uh, I'm confused by Mary Max announcement. Uh, Barry, not Mary, <laughs> Barry Max. Barry Max stated that recharging is, is for inactive accounts. Those involved in cheating and fraudulent. But how come even those clean accounts are affected as well? because they ran out of money. They can't pay you those returns because not enough recruitment was happening. So this is how it was happening. New investments were paying off existing members. This is the only way a Ponzi can work. And like all Ponzi's, once recruitment slows down, they exit scam or they may come, they, they come up with some kind of excuse, right? To what in why they exit scam. And sometimes they don't even make an excuse. They're like, ah, you know, thanks for the money. Goodbye. 
and there's no way to actually find these people. So here we go, you know, Barry Trade or whatever this company is, another Ponzi scheme that screwed over people and, you know, hardworking people. You know, these are all hard, er, hardworking people that got scammed because some affiliate decided to push this crap on them and they got started with them thinking this was legit. So if you know the name of the affiliate, I would never buy from them again. Okay. Never buy. And there's a lot of people on YouTube, a lot of these affiliates on YouTube that keep pushing these Ponzi scams over and over again to stay away from those people. Stop watching their stuff. Like they're putting money in. So this is what they do. They get them, you know, they get started. They put like 50 bucks, hundred bucks in, and then they go, Oh, you know, I made some money. And then they have their affiliate link for that platform underneath that video. So majority of their money is coming from recruitment. They're just, they're just enticing you by showing you, Hey, I put 50 or a hundred or $200 in and look, I made a return. They paid me. Yeah. They, you know, a lot of Ponzi's pay in the beginning, but the truth is most of their money is made by recruiting, you know, hardworking people, right? Hardworking people like the one person lost 20 G's. That's insane to be honest. So anyway, um, stay away from Ponzi's. And what you should do is just follow me, subscribe to this channel, like this video, share this video. I will never promote anything that will hurt my personal credibility. Uh, you know, I've been doing this for 10 years. Okay. So make sure you don't follow those Ponzi scammers. Follow me. I even have free videos on how to like make money online. You can check out my YouTube channel, tons of videos. And also if you want to build a business online, the proper way like that person put 20 G's in if they had that kind of capital to put into in an online business where they can scale it up they would have done amazing right so if you want to learn how to build a business online properly that could ultimately generate passive income visit my website themillionairedrop.com what we will do is we'll make a custom plan for you so if you have a business we can help you scale that business if you don't have a business and have no experience at all at all we can help you step by step on a actual launch plan for that business around your personal passions now again that is the millionaire make sure you check out that website and pay close attention make sure you pay close attention and get started it is less than a coffee at starbucks like we are making this super cheap for everybody so if we did it for free, a lot of people, this is what happens. The freebie seekers don't do anything. They'll get started and then they don't put no effort in. They don't con you know, contact our team for that business plan. So this is why we charge a very small fee just to you know, get rid of those freebie seekers that don't do anything. Even if you put a dollar or two or three dollars in those people, at least, okay, they bought something and they're going to actually go through with it. This is why it's not offered for free. Plus the value you're gonna get here is worth thousands. So it is, again, it's like a Starbucks coffee price, but you're gonna get thousands of dollars worth of value. End of the day, you have a business plan and you can launch at any time you want. So that is the millionairedrive.com. Anyway, that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.